Yo, what's up guys, it's Technology L back here and today in this video, I'll be showing you how can you get rid of this activate windows pop-up that comes at the bottom of your screen. Now, I'll tell it in advance that this video is not for people whose windows is unactivated or your license has expired or something. In my case, I have recently changed my motherboard. Previously, I was running a Gigabyte B450 and I have recently switched out to the MSI B450 Tomahawk. And after that, it has been three days today and all of a sudden I noticed that this activate windows watermark has come on my screen while I already have a digital license key linked to my Microsoft account. So I did a bit of research and what I came to know is that a digital license key is embedded to your hardware. So whenever you change any component of your hardware, whether it be the boot drive, motherboard, your processor, your graphics card, whatever your windows will immediately get deactivated. So you can see here in my status of activation, it shows not active and it automatically detects that one of the hardware components of my computer has changed. So it's going to be really simple. Simply hit that troubleshoot button. You will get this windows activation window pop up. Just hold up for a few seconds. It will detect everything and then you will get this. And at the bottom, you can see it has an option. I changed hardware on this device recently. So just click that button. And now what you need to do is that you simply need to verify that it is your Microsoft account. So you can see that it is detecting my previous version of the same PC. It shows Gigabyte technology from my previous motherboard. So what I'll basically do, I'll extract the product key from that particular hardware and embed it onto my new hardware. So I'll just head up to my Microsoft account and there you can see that I have both the devices listed. Though it is the same PC, but because I have changed the motherboard, the Gigabyte one appears different and the MSI one, which is my current system, it appears as a different machine. So what I'll basically do, head back to the verification window and click this button called activate. Now you just need to sit back patiently and hardly within a minute, you will get this pop up that says windows is activated. And as soon as that, the watermark will disappear from the bottom of your screen. So yes, that's really simple how it works. You just need to tell Microsoft that you have changed the hardware on your machine and they transfer your ID from the previous hardware unit to the newer one which you have updated. So now you can see that my Windows state shows as activated and I'm done for it. You can also try this if you are upgrading any component of your PC. This method will be really useful and you will not have to reinstall Windows again. So yes, that's all for this video. Hope it was interesting and useful for you. If so, drop a like and don't forget to subscribe as we keep bringing up such videos every week. Thanks for watching.